What is happening, YouTube? We are in Gatlinburg again today, up on the uh, Ski Mountain area. We've got a uh, girls' day out, I think it is. I don't know. We've got some ladies that are on a steep driveway with leaves and they have abandoned ship. They say they are afraid to move it. I don't know bad it is but we're gonna see if we can scoot over here and continue straight on the Arvin Court. Continue straight. These roads are really covered though. Uh, I think it's right. It wanted me to go. Oh, I think it wants you to go straight. Yeah, it wants you to go that way. Wrong way. Are you sure? Look at the map. Dead end. Well it looks like we're going to the dead end. Are we going to the dead end? Don't back off your side. Whew. In 1,000 feet, your destination will be on the right. It's so hard to see over the hood of this thing. Where's the road? Where's it? It's over here. <laughs> Can't see it any. <laughs> uh, the road's still over here, honey. It's really steep over there. <laughs> this was not meant for a tow truck. No. Be all right. Hmm. Look at that corner, would you? That looks delicious. Jeez. Did you bring that leaf blower? No, I keep forgetting it. Probably a very valuable thing to have right now. Oh, it would have been great today. This is it. This, that one right back there. That's the driveway there. Okay. Over here. Your destination is on the right. But I don't see their car. Maybe it circles around. I don't know. Just ugh. Mm, it's probably up there. I think this is I think this is the one where we went shout the uh the guy that brought the uh the Ford transit van that got hung up over there in the snow. Mm. I think that's it. This is this is the address right here, 1646. Why does it have a mailbox? See it? Call. Do you want? Uh, do you want? Let's call it. I'll probably just walk up around the corner. Does it? I think it doubles back. Because I don't think. Yeah. You just want to hang out here? Because I don't think that this doesn't look like a rental. There's a mailbox there. Well, the GPS shows it. Mm -hmm. What did she get? She gave me the address though, 1646. This mm -hmm. is supposed to be it. Okay, bear with me, YouTube. Oh, golly, I fell out of that thing. Probably. We're on foot. I don't know that I can squeeze a tow truck on this road. I don't, I don't think it's wide enough for that. Well, I'm seeing tire marks on the side of this rock, and, and then, I mean, I guess I could ride the cross top. It doesn't sound very promising. Found it. Hey, this is Jeff, Everything Auto. I'm out here with the little Nissan. Ah, uh, yes, I will be there right there. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Hello. 
Hello. Are we going down? That way. Okay. Hello, guys. Hi. So I don't, I don't think I could get a tow truck up here. So maybe we can do some wiggling. Well, the car you can drive it. Yeah, it just uh, you just need to get turned around so you guys can safely go back down, right? Do you the, think we if can you get just up here and do like a, or no? It might. Um, Cause that's what we were scared of. You know, it's a group of girls. They, like let go the brake and then. Yeah, yeah. So I don't know, whatever. It's yeah, so you got those are the keys. Yeah. Let's see if we can get you up here and get you turned around. Hopefully, uh, if or, I can't, then we might just back all the way back or down. Or do you back all? Of, if you can back just all the way down and just leave it. Leave it down at the bottom. Yeah. Down on the bottom, set, like going to leave. That way you and guys. And we're can. not go, go coming up again. I'm sorry you're having troubles. These. Um. <laughs> all these. All yeah. these was yeah, we here. We arrived yesterday. And, and it was they were completely like wet. wet. So you can. So see instead of these. having a vacation, you work. Yeah, basically. <laughs> so we they, they clean we didn't do anything all day because we were like you can't oh, get out. Yeah, you can't get anywhere. That's the problem with these places. They won't come. And, and it's not a and it's not a four four by four. So I don't know. Like yeah, yeah, they won't. Yeah, they don't want to come to this area, and Why? it's uh, it's just really steep, and it, it gets uh, yeah, a lot of times like like there's no way I could get a tow truck up here. You know. you yeah, yeah, you just can't get it. It's it's too narrow to get up here. So hopefully we can get it wiggled and, and get it back down. I don't I don't think we'll need a, a truck up here. So, yeah. but yeah, let me let me see what it'll do here first, and then we'll. Uh, okay. So I think that's what I'll do is, well, I, I think I think there might be enough room there for me yeah, to turn around. There was, yeah. Okay. Sorry, YouTube. Not much of a view here. So are you guys going to be, are you guys going to be good with taking it down, turned around, or do no. you want me to put it at the bottom? No, can you put it at the bottom? Yeah, that's, I, I was getting ready to say it's probably going to be better because that corner is still probably really slick if you're going, I don't want you guys to slide into that fence or anything like that. So, yeah. um, okay, well, let me get it down there to the bottom and then I'll come back up with you guys. Save that receipt because your insurance company will reimburse you for okay. me being here. Okay. But I'll get that receipt ready and I'll meet you back up here okay. at the top. You just want me to lock it and leave, uh, bring the keys back to you? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. I will do. Um, we'll go, we go down there. Just make, yeah, just make sure it's just ready to go. Right. Yeah, so you guys can just get oh in it and God. go. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you, guys. You yeah, thank you. <laughs> I'm sorry you guys didn't have a, a lot of fun because you couldn't get anywhere. That's awful. Um, I, I would even submit this receipt to your people that you rented from. They are not taking responsibility. Like, See that's. She just, I was like in your husband or somebody coming up and help us just to move the car, just to drive it. Then. See that's because just not all acceptable. These was like completely full of leaves, wet. 
so you can you, see it. Oh, I can see where you guys have cleared all of the leaves everywhere. Yeah, that's that's not acceptable. I and mean, and then when that, so we were when, when um the car started sleeping, like we all got all just got out. Car. Yeah, and then um, she almost hit the fence. So she just put the brake and just left it. Like if this thing falls down. I was like, you pull somebody. I'm, not, I'm not going in there with it. Yeah. No, you guys did the perfect thing. A lot of folks will keep on going, and then before you know it, they're, you know, over that fence or tearing up their car. So you did the perfect thing, but I would like to see her yeah, either she, give you some sort of I, discount I or. I usually drive, drive that, but she ended up doing it because I was. Yeah. Yeah, that's just that's just not acceptable for you guys to have to be responsible for. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, you paid the money to stay here. They should have had everything ready for you guys. So. But uh, okay, let me get this down to the bottom and okay. we'll get that. I'll meet you back up. See if we can make our way down. This is a very sketchy driveway. I mean, I'm glad they've got a fence, but is that fence really gonna stop this 4,000 pound car? Well, I don't think so. Hey, I'm just glad I didn't have to try to figure out how I was going to get a tow truck up here. Because that's, I mean, you can't even, I could barely get this little car through here. If you had a, if you had a full-size pickup, uh, that would be tough. Sorry, YouTube, probably a crappy video because I'm inside the car and. They look like bear prints on the side of that. Or the windshield. Yeah, they do look like bear prints. I don't know. It's kind of a smaller print right there, but. It's definitely bear prints. Well, they've got food in there, so. Oh. Yeah. Whoops. Bear prints all over the windshield, and we've got uh, yeah, we've got boxes of boxes of food in the floorboard, so. Right we'll have to let them know they need to get that. Oh wow, yeah. Yeah, those are all bear, bear. bear print, bear prints. He's trying to look at himself in the mirror there. Okay, guys, it's uh, yeah, a very steep driveway. Luckily, we didn't have to go up. And I mean, look at all the trash over there from the bear. I see it scattered all over this hillside. I'm betting if you hung around here long enough, you'd probably, probably catch him. But anyway, we're going to get this thing, uh, get a ticket made, get her, her receipt so maybe she can get her money back. And we will see you guys on the next one. Welcome to uh, Bear Drop In. Looks like the bear dropped in and had him some uh, Krispy Kreme. Maybe, uh, maybe some Kool-Aid. Yep. Drop in. We do have uh, still some pretty good color up here, guys. I don't know if you can see the mountain, but I'll give you a little footage of Ski Mountain.
Hello. Hey, how are you? Hey, you're really in there. Yeah. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? That's it. I'm sorry for Mitch. Alright, you're there. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, they drove in from Michigan today. I drove in from Charlotte, North Carolina. Made it. I was three minutes away from where I was going. Oh. And I was supposed to go up this street. So I went to turn around. Yeah. And, um,. Um, and when I noticed that I was, I don't know, I went to put the brake and my foot slipped and I kind of just shot forward. Just went forward, yeah. yeah. And no, all it all happened so fast, I'm assuming that's what happened. <laughs> yeah, no, it happens. It happens. Crazy old roads down here. They are. So we're certainly hoping that it cools up and drives okay. Yeah, that's, uh, that's what I'm going to hope too.
bit here. Looks like there's a screw in there already. Not too bad. Over here, you can see. Okay. Yeah, they'll, they're gonna probably pop out of them. Yeah. Yeah, I think you were really fortunate that the airbags didn't deploy. Yeah. So that's good. That's the difference of driving at home and getting a new car. It's oh, I just want you to come working for my <laughs> You see it's broken there a little bit. Yeah, that's okay. Okay. I mean, that's a... Oh, he doesn't. Yeah. right there it's a very sharp yeah. ledge right there right, so, so, when he, so when he backed it up it must have lifted it up he made like a ramp basically oh, yeah yes yeah it makes it just a, and you can see right here where you were dug in that's where your frame was dug in yeah and that's why he needed to build up underneath yeah. it so we don't drag we pull Started here. Okay, guys, uh, we're heading out on this call. We got her taken care of there. Um, the, um, the insurance company, her roadside assistance, they, they left her. They kind of dropped the ball again on this. We see it a lot. Um, she said she'd been over here for three, almost four hours uh, in this ditch right here. She's, you know, of course she's here and she's not enjoying her vacation, and that's definitely no fun. Uh, but we're. Uh, Rattlesnake Hollow Road. If you guys are in Gatlinburg, you come off 321 and you have to stay in any of these cabins in this area. Uh, just know that the same as most of the areas, uh, the roads have some pretty deep ravines. So I, it's always safe. I know we've said it before, but here it comes again. If you've got to turn around in an area, let your passenger get out and just open up their phone light and and just kind of guide you you know while you're trying to turn around because backup cameras and mountains are not they're just not a good thing so just uh try to be safe and um hey if you're not safe and you end up in that spot don't forget to call everything auto all right guys back at it it's uh about 11 o'clock at night here on this sunday rainy afternoon and just as expected with the leaves and the rain we've got quite a few calls we've got two lined up now that are in the ditch here this guy says he's got a nissan titan and we just turned around and missed his missed his spot here so let's see if we can get him out It should be over there somewhere. see his headlights tell him to come down this driveway which driveway uh, let me i'm just going over and meet him how's that is it the one that says do not enter <laughs> we didn't see that side. It's, it's i think it says pine i think it says pineway drive or something like that i see his truck lights i'm walking up there now okay. my gps got me off on this down here and i got stuck okay are we headed in the right direction 
Uh, you're right there. Like I said, I see the truck. Uh, he just pulled down the driveway. Okay. Then he went to the other one. So tell him to come back to where he just was. I think you need to go that way. Where I was just I think. It's just a gravel. I see the truck right there. Does he need to turn right come. or left? Uh, I'm looking at the front of the truck. I think it's to your right. Okay. Yeah, I see. Yeah, see, yeah, come down this way right here. Yeah, I'm standing. Yeah, y'all coming the right way. Okay. I don't thank you. Is it this one? Yes. Okay. Uh, just keep coming. I'm walking right here. All right. Thank you. No, mate. So that's good. Yes, guys here we are in the shag bark community again we've got uh, a customer called in they walked to the rest of the way to their cabin because um they don't have a car anymore it's teetering in this little small tiny little ditch oh that back tire is way off the ground do you see that
yeah, you're supposed to go up there and get the keys, but I don't know if, our, if the truck will make it. Oh, the truck will make it. It's just off camber right there. So. Oh, okay. But if I, I guess. It's, it says is it, it's, is it says it's up this way? Three quarters of a mile, yeah. and we will be right back with you. All right, YouTube, we're back. We got some keys. I'm gonna see if I can put you in here where it's nice and not rainy and maybe I can wrap you around the steering with this fantastic Amazon mount. Hey, it's not bad. So hang tight right there, YouTube. The windshield wipers are going to annoy you and we're gonna get some things hooked up and get this thing out of the ditch.
YouTube. See if we can get this car back to the customer. All right, YouTube, the customer, the customer was like, I'm not driving that car back up this mountain. My wife is a trooper. She's hopped in this thing and, and we're headed up this super slick mountain right now. And I'm sorry, you probably can't see where I'm going. It's like really foggy and really slick. She's up there catch a glimpse of her flashers here. I'm trying to keep the headlights off of her. So once it goes back to fog, she can actually see. But uh, we did get them out of the ditch and the customers terrified there. Uh, they said their other vehicle barely made it up here. And uh, this one obviously didn't, it ended up in the ditch. Uh, but uh, yes, my wife is a trooper. She's, she's motoring up this thing and keeping me from towing it up here. I really don't want to tow it. I mean, I could, but it's gonna be way easier to, to just drive up this road. So, anyway, hang tight. We're gonna see if we can make it up. Okay, safe and sound with the Kia. I've got a little bit more light on the subject coming up. Like I said, I had those lights turned off because I didn't want to blind my wife as she courageously <laughs> navigated the, the mountain up here. But uh, you can see it's a little foggy and you really can't see the road at all, especially some of the corners. But uh, lots of leaves, lots of wet stuff, and on the other side of that is a huge drop off of the mountain. So if you're lucky, you get a couple of trees that'll catch you on the way down. But uh, nasty old night. I'm assuming that we're probably going to get live. several more calls for the winch out season. But uh, yeah, I thought I'd give you guys a little more footage getting down out of. Uh, shag bark so if you're ever renting in the shag bark community just keep in mind the weather will uh change your plans drastically those folks you know they're here and they don't they didn't have a lick of groceries no water the uber uh gal was nice enough to run them back up some water because they're terrified they can't get out um so they're gonna hopefully have enough comforts to get them through here Unless the rain lets up, but the fog is crazy tonight. So we're going to get uh, scooting back up on out of uh, Shag Bark, and uh, we'll be off to the next call whenever, whenever that might be, and whenever that comes in. But thanks for tagging along, guys.